five states and generally when we came in in the morning we thought about five hours and we'd all be done and get ourselves a nice lunch but guess what it is past three Madhya Pradesh is nowhere close to deciding who's going to form the next government there but luckily for us at least four states seem to be more or less clear how do things stand right now in Rajasthan the Congress has gone past the halfway mark they're at 103 the halfway is a hundred BJP is at 70 Telangana TRS extremely comfortable at 85 Congress 21 the Mahakutmi failing to make much of an impact was supposed to be a master stroke of an alliance between the TDP and the Congress not quite Mizoram Congress swept out of power the caretaker chief minister has lost both of the seats he contested on the Congress doing very badly on other seats as and it is the Mizo National Front an ally of the BJP at the center and a part of the NEDA in the Northeast which has come into power but look at that Madhya Pradesh Congress now at 113 BJP at 106 others 11 of which five are from the BSP she has asked Mayavati has asked all of her MLAs to rush to Delhi and for good reason because already the phone lines they are a ringing signal is very positive for 2019 if you look historically at the elections for these states at this time in the year before the elections for the last four elections you will find that whoever won these states has always carried them in the Lok Sabha also and with a higher margin now given that last time BJP won 62 states seats out of 68 in these states I would argue that now uh, this is pretty bad news for the BJP पांच राज्यों के विधानसभा चुनाव के नतीजे अब करीब करीब खत्म हो चुके हैं और उसके बाद अब एक के बाद एक प्रतिक्रिया इस पर आना शुरू हो गया है कांग्रेस एक तरीके से रिवाइवल के मोड में है क्योंकि खास करके छत्तीसगढ़ और राजस्थान में कांग्रेस सीधे सीधे सरकार बनाती नजर आ रही है लेकिन इसके बाद अब बीजेपी में क्या चल रहा है क्या सोच रहे हैं बीजेपी के सांसद हमारे साथ संजय काकड़े राज्यसभा सांसद है बीजेपी के संजय जी आपने कहा कि कहीं ना कहीं बीजेपी अपने मुद्दों से भटक रही है जो दो में बीजेपी ने वादे किए थे क्या कहना है नहीं अभी जो पांच राज्यों के नतीजे जो आपके सामने आए वो हमें चौंकाने वाले हैं इसका रीज़न मैं खुद सोच रहा हूँ कि मैं राजस्थान और मध्य प्रदेश और छत्तीसगढ़ के तीनों स्टेट का मैंने सर्वे किया था अच्छी खासी तो राजस्थान और छत्तीसगढ़ को मुझे मालूम था कि हम लोग वहाँ वीक हो गए मतलब किसी कारण हम लोग नहीं जीत पाएंगे मगर मध्य प्रदेश का मुझे खुद को भी शौक है दो के जो मुद्दे थे मोदी साहब के जो डेवलपमेंट पर मुद्दे थे विकास का विकास का मुद्दा था वो शायद भटक गए हमारा और हमें लगता है कि ये विकास का मुद्दा लेके दो हज़ार उन्नीस में जाना चाहिए ना कि जात पात का मंदिर का या स्टैचू का या नामकरण का Well, you will hear plenty of such voices like that of Mr. Kakre already. Shiv Sena, the Shirobani Akali Dal. You already have these alliance partners talking about maybe how the Modi wave doesn't have the same kind of pull the charm as it did earlier. That the center's policies are the ones to blame, not just the state leaders. Thanks for watching the video. For more such news and updates, please like, share, and subscribe to India Today. Also, check out our other great videos from our channel. We know you would love to.